Hello, and thank you for clicking on the video. In this video, we're going to do another short tutorial in Final Cut, showing you how to do the title text behind the subject. So let's get into it. Okay, so I'm going to drag my media into the timeline. In this case, it's going to be a picture. Then I'm going to drag my basic title onto the image type in the text that I want and then choose the font. Then change the size and drag it into position. Then all you need to do is copy the image and put that image above the first image but also above the title. Then you want to drop the draw mask onto the top image and draw around with a mask around the subject that you want the text to go behind. It will help if you put as many control points as possible so that you've got space to play with if you need to move them around. Once you've done this, you may need to play with these control points by moving them further in, further out, and you may also need to play with the feathering and the fall off. Quite happy with how that's come out. So turn that into a compound clip and there we are. Let's do another example. So I'll drag this picture in. I'm gonna do the exact same thing. Drag my basic title on. Put the text that I want. I'm going to choose the font, then choose the size. This one I'm gonna give a slight rotation. Then copy the clip, paste it over the original clip and the title. I find if I disable the top clip, then you're able to see the text that's behind it. Whereas if you have it enabled, you can't see the text that's behind it. Then once you've chosen the control points, you can re-enable the clip. Then just play with the feathering again. And I found with this one, if I bring the opacity back down a bit and let some of the text show through, it actually gives it a better effect. This one might look quite good actually as a cinema graph if the waterfall was moving. I've got another tutorial for that and I'll link it in the top corner. Then just turn that into a compound clip and that one's done. Finally is the difficult one and that is to do it with video. Okay, so I've selected my video, drop that into the timeline, same process. Drop the title onto it, just a basic title. Write the text, choose my font, change the size. Copy and paste the clip, put it over the top, drop a draw mask onto it, and choose as many control points as you think is needed. I'm going to zoom in here so that I can be really specific with the control points. Then this is the difficult part with Final Cut. Because you can't motion track, you're going to need to go frame by frame. So you start at the very start of the clip. You go over to the transforms under the draw mask and you're going to need to set the control points and keyframe them. Then move across one frame using the arrow key. And then if you're lucky and your clip figure isn't moving very much, you can move the entire mask that you've created and pull the whole thing across. Or if you're unlucky, you're gonna to need to move control point by control point slowly, frame by frame, as I'm having to do here. And then right arrow again for the next frame, move the control points again and repeat again, again, and again. I'll speed this up here. And there, once you've repeated the process a million times, you'll get your final results. And I'll show you that now. So that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope it was helpful in some way, and I'll see you in the next one. Mm -hmm.